have arrived to my second home. We're back in Edinburgh. I'm delighted. I think Mar's annoyed because I keep calling it home. Um, but yeah, my lovely mum is coming to meet us, pick us up. And then we're going to head for a cup of tea and then to bed, I think. That was a, a long journey for a 45 minute flight. Here we go, back to the rain. <laughs> Comes in very handy, that Viking. It would be really funny if mum just drove up right behind him right now. Come on, cars. No, neither are her. <laughs> It's kind of weird at first when the pumpkin started screaming, but then the scream stopped. He loves having the camera turned on. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm just going to set you there. Um, so I'm back in Edinburgh and tonight I'm meeting up with one of my friends who is a blogger and kind of Instagram person. Um, she does a lot of really cool photography, so I'll link her account um, down below. But we are going to a blogger or vlogger event tonight at Cavalry Voltaire. So I'm currently parked in Chamber Street. This is the Chamber Street Museum over the road and my university building is right here. Uh, so it's kind of taking me back. Um, but yes, I'm just getting ready to go out and meet her now. So tonight is a kind of pop-up restaurant of Japanese food um, at Cavalry Voltaire. I have not been to anything like this before, so it'll be really interesting. And I think we're basically just getting to kind of mingle and eat some yummy food. I love Japanese food, um, so that will be really, really interesting and yummy to enjoy. Um, Ingemar is out with my mum and her partners tonight. They've gone for a curry, so we're both having a very yummy night. But I will take you along and we will see what it's like inside. I just do a spot the bloggers, you can definitely tell what's going on here. Brilliant! This is what it's like before you even have any food. <laughs> one dish, and this many people trying to take photographs. <laughs> this is brilliant! This is Nori's um, cauldron with spiders on for collecting all of her treats when trick or treating. And this is her outfit and then we've got a Ted down the stairs coming up as well we've got a bat on the back somewhere around here very uh, quick <laughs> quick babysitting outfits so we've got a pumpkin up here and we're ready to go oh the papers come out let's go guising come on then got the grandkids initials on for Grand Rosa. That's him off. He's over there. I don't know if you can see him. There. <laughs> <laughs> Bye Angers. See you in a week. Hey guys. So it's Thursday. I can't remember the last time I actually vlogged. It was maybe when Ingemar was heading to the airport and flying back to Iceland. So he's gone back home. He went on Sunday and I am here for another week to just see family and 
get cuddles from lots of toddlers and babies. <laughs> so I've been catching up with my sister and her brand new baby boy. Um, and yeah, Nori and Ted, as usual, playing with them and just generally hanging out. I've been lifting Ted a lot and I pulled a muscle which weirdly has moved from my neck to my back. So I'm in a lot of pain right now. Um, so trying to distract from that by having a massage booked tonight at the college where they do training. So um, it's a good kind of way of um, getting a much more affordable massage. <laughs> um, but yes, today we are going through to Glasgow to see the murals that have just been painted for Billy Connolly. Um, Billy Connolly is a very famous Scottish actor and comedian. He has just received a knighthood from the Queen. So it is a very important cultural event um, and it'll be really cool to see. So we've got that and I think we're going to try and pick up some cashmere jumpers as well. Ready for winter, going back on Monday. Um, and tomorrow, we're very, very lucky we have been invited to uh, the opening of a new exhibition by Joe Lomo, who is a, again, a Scottish painter. Um, so a bit of a cultural couple of days. <laughs> this is it's not like Scotland is it uh, so we're now at Kelvin Grove gallery where there's a big organ and a whole load of stuff that mum just told me about I wasn't really listening uh, but amazingly I have never been here before I think I've been to look at the building but never inside so we're gonna go in and have a little look around and hopefully listen to the organ <laughs> Okay, so that's Philly Connolly about 20 years ago. Okay. <laughs> Tonight we're off to a Joe Lamo private viewing at a local art gallery, which is pretty exciting. So um, there's already quite a lot of people inside and it's very colourful. Yay, let's get going. Oh, that was amazing. I feel so inspired. I just want to buy loads of oil and get painting now. But he's such a down to earth, genuine, lovely guy, and his work is just amazing. Perfect. 
time and look at that beautiful Scottish sky. <laughs> it's no different than Iceland. And a rainbow. This is my Scottish autumnal look. <laughs> so we're in Kuros, uh, which is in the north of Scotland. Well, not really the north. It's in Fife. Um, and we're just having a nosy around. It's kind of last couple of days I've been in Scotland. So this is the palace over here. Bessie's we're gonna open, go and have. Mm, if it is open, I think it just shuts we're gonna for the whole winter. Go and have a look inside, but it's a nice yeah, colour, isn't it? Beautiful. Look at that. Scotland version of the Hovis Road. <laughs> oh, yay! This is very cute, neighbourly, small village type thing. Mm -hmm. 